Today we have the middle school football team versus Westford middle school football team. I'm Matthew Cardillo for the announcer. We got Chris Williams for cameraman. Uh, today's a pretty good day. It's a little, a little cloudy, but you know, nice cool wind, beautiful day. I think this is gonna good, be a good matchup. Um, I don't know the stats for the team, but I heard they're doing very good. Um, they're about to start soon, so uh, here we go. Okay, so I guess the game is underway. Don't know who got the coin toss. Oh, wait. It looks like we are kicking it off. So they are receiving the ball at their own 20. Here we go, boys. Boom, 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 boom. Okay, here we go. What number is that, bro? What number is that? 60. Who is it? 60. I know, I don't know. Is it 60? What's his name? I can't. Oh, 80. Avery is about to kick off for the middle school team. Hopkinton, here we go. Looks like the game is underway. Oh. 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 We got the ball. No, we didn't. Down at their down at the 40. So yeah, I think uh I think this team I think Westfield Westwood's good team. I think uh Middle Hopkinton's a good team. It's <laughs> it's uh it's gonna be a good game, good good matchup between the two. We got Wyatt Stevens for the quarterback. They are on the 47. Oh, so I guess we did get the ball. <laughs> My bad. Sorry about that. Oh, here we go. Why it's running. It's going. Oh, oh. He made it really far, actually. They're out there. All the way to the 22-yard line. Impressive run from Wyatt Stevens. Thanks, Chris. Yeah! <laughs> we got a couple. We got a lot of fans coming in now. Cheering both teams. We got some Westfield, Westwood team fans, and we got some. I don't think we got some. Here. Move over a little bit. Sorry about that. Okay. So, they're at their 22. Wyatt Stevens is about to... Oh, down to... Oh, nice job. That was a good one by Will. I think the Hopkins team has good chemistry. They all work good together. That's it's gonna be a good game. Good game. So the first down. First down. Second down, my bad. <laughs> couldn't see the couldn't see the marker. Thought it was first. At the ten. Really close to the end zone. White snaps it, 
Up to Will. Will. Oh, he got taken down. He gained some yardage. Two yards. He gained two yards. Third down at their own 15. <laughs> nope. Their own know, 9, 10, 8. Their own 8. No, that's not 7. That is 7, I think. Yeah, it is at their own 7. Think why it's gonna pass it to Will again for the run. Oh no, why it's gonna run? He's gonna run all the way. Will he get it? Touchdown, Hopkinton. Nice job. That was a good executed play by Will. Nope, not Will. <laughs> Part of my French. That was good. That was a good executed play by Wyatt Stevens. Good run all the way up. Are they going for two? I'm confused. Oh, I guess they called the touchdown back. Wyatt, will he make it? Oh. He did not make it. We now have a kickoff to Westwood from Hopkinton. Thank you, Chris. Did I ever tell you that this sandwich is really good? <laughs> I wish they had the scoreboard running so we know what, how much time left. What's the score? I guess they don't keep track. You know what? You know what I like to think? Game of football is just for fun. Okay. We got Avery kicking it off to Westwood. I don't see his number. That was a good kick. Good kick. Can't see his number, so I can't tell. Number 30. Oh, there's no number 30. This is out of order, bro. I guess I was wrong. I guess it's 32. Hmm, Matt. I don't know. The ball's in the Hopkins in 47. Tony passed it over. Ball went out of bounds. Good executed play by the Hopkinton defense. It's second and ten. At the Hopkinton forty seven. Tony passes it over to number I can't see his number. That was good yardage by Westwood. I think they got the first down. It is now first down. First and four at first and ten. My bad. I'm sorry. I'm new at this, okay? 
I'll get better. Tony passes it up to number eight. I can't, I don't know his name. Like Mike Tarosian, okay? He's really good at this. <laughs> I'm gonna, Mike, if you're editing this or everything, heard about this, please tell me how you do it. Because this is it's just really difficult to remember the names, where they are. This wind keeps blowing my paper. Westfield is going up. Oh, good, good yardage by Westfield. Good old. Clap by me. I'm going to hand it over to Chris so he can say a couple words. We now have a first and 10 at Westwood's 30 yard line. Here comes the snap. snap. The snap was taken by Tony. Oh, he's running up the sideline. Knocked out of bounds. Yeah. We now have a Westwood first down at the 15 yard line. Snap is underway. Tony snaps it. Up to the the runner, he's passed it to. Second down at the 10 yard line. Fans are more pooling in around here. Cheering for both teams. Oh, number four is going all the way. Up to, oh, they lost. That was some good defense by Hopkinton. Gain like four. <laughs> We now have a first and goal situation at the five yard line. Thank you, Chris. Snaps underway. Tony passes it over to 80. Gain a couple yards. Second down. They gained two yards, actually. Third down. Get out of here, bug. <laughs> they are on there. Second down. No, it's third down. I think they got a touchdown. Yep. Westwood just got a touchdown. Woo! <laughs> Good job, Westwood. <laughs> nah. It's all tied up, I think. Really? Oh. My bad. It's 7 0. 6 0, actually. Why do they do that? They're going for their extra point. And they have executed the extra point. That was a two point conversion by Westwood. Westwood's about to kick off to Hopkinton. From there.
Westwood is teaching off from the 40-yard line. Wyatt Stevens, Davin, no, Wyatt or, I can't read the other guy's name, are going to receive. Tommy received the ball at their 38. Got a dog on the field. I think it's the mascot. What's up, dude? How you doing? You're cool. <laughs> Kids these days. Is this the middle school? We're at the high school. I knew that. Oh. This dog is really chilling. Love to see it. What's his name? Charles? Barkley? Oh, he's looking at me. I'm going to wink at him. <laughs> this might not be any good footage to do. The commentating is pretty hard. Mike Terosian, I give you 100% cred. Okay. Any day now. They're on there at 39. They're on 39. What? They just switched sides. Can they do that? Snaps underway. Whistle was blown. White snaps it. He's getting ready to throw. He just gets sacked. Lost yardage. Good play by Westwood. That sack makes it a second and 20 situation. Thanks, Chris, again. <laughs> if you like our commentating, leave a like on below. Subscribe to HHS TV. <laughs> Why are girls staring at us? Boot the loot. <laughs> Sorry, Mr. Cousins. Good guy. White is telling them the play. They are getting ready to snap the ball. Passes it over to What's his name? What did they say? J Lo? No. Jacob. With a gain of only two yards, they are now at a third and eighteen. Jesus. Okay. I think. It's a good game so far. What do you think? Solid game so far. I think it's back and forth. Good defense, good offense on both sides. Wyatt's ready, getting ready to sna snap the ball. Oh, that dog's barking now. Wyatt's getting ready. Oh, dropped the ball. Gained no yardage. That means Hoptington will most likely kick 
back off with a punt over to Westwood. Back to this dog. This dog's just chilling. <laughs> Westfield's got a good, good turf. Vibe. Are they going for it? No, they're not going for it. He's kicking it off. Whistle was blown. I think that is the end of the first. My name is Kurt. My name is Nina. And Kai? I'm Haley. Hi, my name is Jake. We're the Hiller Volleyball Team. My name is Emma. My name is May. My name is Shelby. My name is Sophie. We're Alma and Gal, and we love HCAMP. Hey, I want to be a camp. We love HCAMP. And I volunteer for HCAMP TV. I watch HCAM TV. And I love HCAM TV. And I love HCAM TV. We love HCAM TV. Woo! And the players are coming back on the field now. It is Westwood's ball, I believe. The punt. Over to around the 50. And it goes out of bounds at the 45. Hand off to just past the 50. Injured player, timeout. We have Hopkinton coach Mike Webb walking out now. Have Joe Carraza walking, being carried off the field now. To the look of it, it looks like he's one of the Westfield guys landed on his leg, twisted or something. Let's hope he feels better. We now have a Westfield second down at the 50-yard line. Westwood. I keep saying that. 
a little confusing. But dog's still staring at me. Thank you, Matt. No problem, Chris. Anytime. We got Tony in the backfield. Oh. What number was he? Westwood touchdown ran from all the way. Okay. I was looking for the name. The name, bro. These are not the right names. What number was he? So they are not going for a two-point conversion. This is like their... Because they can't kick it over that, so maybe that's their extra point. Let's see if Westwood would get their extra point. And they succeed getting the extra po point. Po point. <laughs> Cartwheels. Love him. Dog is still staring at me. I think he wants to meet me. Oh, now he wants to drink a coffee. Ah, a little energy. No, 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 no big deal. Okay, let's get back to the game, Matt. Come on. It is 16-6, Westwood. Westwood be kicking off to the Hopkinton team. Wyatt. Oh, I can't get his name. What's his number? What's his number? Wyatt will be receiving the ball. He dropped it. He'll be running. He's going up. Oh, 40. Stopped at the 58. 48, I mean 48. Sorry. Got knocked out of bounds at the 48. That was a good run by Wyatt. The first down will start from the 45-yard line. I think it's good weather for this game. A lot, little, not too cold, not too, not too warm. Just the right breeze, so you don't really, really sweat. Just good football weather. Okay, we're getting ready for the snap. Why is getting ready to throw? Oh, and he just threw it off because he got pressured by the Westwood defense. This dog's still staring at me, by the way. <laughs> You just saw that dog. We're going to name him Hiller for our Hiller mascot. So he's going to be the mascot for the day. I don't know if that's the father of the Westwood team. I'm thinking to, but the dog certainly likes the Hillers. Okay, now we're getting ready for the snap. White snaps the ball. Up to 22. They gained lost yardage. No. Gain like one. Let's say that. Still something. Still something. Stirred down. Oh, they lost yardage. Oh, did they get the first down? No. They are really close to the first down, though. No, they're not really close. Just kidding. Just a prank, bro. 
Let's not go, Westwood. <laughs> oh, Wyatt Stevens. Oh, he catches the ball. He's going. The 50. Uh, he gets the first down. Good run. Executed by Wyatt Stevens. He fumbled the ball a little bit. The ball was in the air, and he still figured out how to catch it, and he still just... Went on with the play until he got sacked. Good play overall. That puts the ball at Westwood's 39, nope, 44-yard line. This is fun. I want to do this more often. <laughs> Let's go Hillers. Here's the snap. Formation. Oh, he's going. I think he got, I think he's a little. I don't think he got the first down. Couple inches away from the first down. They are at the 44. Second down. Got some balloons over here. Got some fans cheering. I love the atmosphere around here. White Stevens. Over, oh, lost some yardage right there. Oh, I think the ball's. They lost some yardage. Did it fumble? Did they fumble? A fumble, it was a fumble, and the West Wood team got the ball. The mascot's not very happy, if you can tell. Looking a little mad, so he decided to sit down and cool down. It's all good. Don't worry, Charles. Nope. Hiller. <laughs> we will get it back. Got a good team over here. Tony? Oh! Oh, he's rushing really good. Took a couple of Hillary guys to knock him down. They are at their 55. Forty-five. Let's go, Hillers. Mascot's really cheering for us. Yeah, Hiller. Oh, he got out of it. He's going. Oh, he's still going. Knocked down at there. 41. Easy first down by Westwood on that run. If I do say so myself, Matthew. Thanks, Chris. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> the mascot's staring at me again. He really wants to see me. Pass it off. Okay. That is very big bunch right there. Didn't know where the whistle was. They finally decided to blow it. Westwood is at a 38-7. Second down. Third down. Third down. Second down. I think it's second down. Tony's about to throw it. 
Oh, good pass. But they did not get the first down. They are pushed out of bounds at the... Oh, ref just dropped the ball. They're, they're still at the 47, 37. Got a whistle timeout on uh, Westwood. Timeout's over. We are back to the game. It's third down. Passed over. He got the first down. Pushed out of bounds right after. Flag on the play. See what they're about to say. There was a flag thrown on the field. Oh, they got pushed back yards. They got pushed back all the way to the 47 on a third down. That is some big distance to make up for what they just lost. Thanks, Chris. Snap underway. Tony's about to throw it. Oh, almost sacked, but he's going to run it up to the 41, 42 actually. But they did not get the first down. It is f fourth down. I think they're going to punt it to the Hillers or they're going to go for it. I think they're going for it. Fourth down. Fourth and 12, and they're going for it? What do you think? That's a tough one. Uh, that's a good field advantage if uh, Hopkins can, can stop this one. That will really, really do good for the Hopkins if they can somehow. Oh. Okay. We have a timeout on the Hillers. It mascot Hiller is really cheering for the team. <laughs> Did he, oh, let's see if they get the first down. He's going. Oh, knocked out of bounds. They did not get the first down. So that means that is good, good field advantage for the Hillers. Good play, good play by the defense. It is end of the first. 
Have you ever considered texting and driving? If so, you should know the consequences. If caught texting and driving for the first time, you could get an $100 fine plus your license taken away for 60 days. The consequences only get worse the more you get caught. Even if you don't get caught, there could be serious effects. You could get into a car accident and hurt yourself or someone else. Texting and driving is a very dangerous combination, so stop before this happens to you. Okay, so that was the end of the first. Now we're on to the second quarter. Looks like Westwood's going to be kicking off to Hopkinton. Is he coming? We've got Hayden Van Beek on here. Hayden! Hayden Van Beek is the brother of... Evan, number 77 for Hopkinton. We are about to have kickoff to Hopkinton from the 40 yard line. Picked up right near the 49 by Hopkinton. That was Andrew Button. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so, Mr. Van Beek is over here. Hayden Van Beek. What? Van Beek, don't call me. He snapped. Oh, okay. Not playing against the game. Sorry about that. Don't know what happened, so we're just going to forget about that. We are at the 50-yard line. We got the mascot in the house. Still, still rapping. He is? Yeah. We got Wyatt Stevens. About to kick off. Uh, nope. Wyatt's going to throw it. It was dropped. It is second down. Third down, actually. Third down. How did I... We were reading the, um, we were reading the paperwork on the bus, and we were like, Chris is like, that's Hayden, Ben. That's the MB. We got uh, Mr. Van Beek's uh, brother here. Okay, he doesn't want to talk. How did you know I was going to be on there? Did you just look at my snap map? <coughs> okay, sorry. Got Wyatt Stevens. Ow. He's going to throw it. Oh, he's going to run it, actually. They're at their 50. There was no gang on that. You know what, Hayden? It's fourth down. I know that. I'm not an idiot. I can see it right there. Okay? I know football somewhat, somewhat here. Optington still has 10 yards on this this drive. It'll be a tough one if they go for it. Looks like they're going for it. Hopkinton comes up to the line. Wyatt gets into position. Looks like they will pass this off. Wyatt runs to the right by the sideline. He runs. Gets the first yard and some. He, no, he actually is really good. 
Like, you are really good. Huh? Oh? Oh? <laughs> uh, we got a mascot over here. His name's Hiller, the dog. So, Mr. Hiller. Yeah, we're going to edit all this out. I can talk during this because no one really cares about this. Okay, we're back to the play. Here we go, boys. Wyatt Stevens. I feel like I'm, that's not the name. Who's number 10? What? Snaps. He's going to run. 30. The, the 20. The 10. Touchdown, Wyatt Stevens. What? You want to fight, buddy? Yeah. We're doing Wednesday, too. No, there's another game somewhere else. Yeah. Okay, then go. She get Dylan here. We could smoke the what? Wyatt Stevens. Oh, he gets out of the tackle. Oh. There was a no extra point. Which one's yours? Evan. Hopkinton kickoff to Westwood. Kick off. Westwood got the ball at their own 20-yard line. Timeout called. Did you know there are other ways to reduce your pain besides taking medications? For example, mindfulness. I'm Dr. Mike Guidi, family medicine doctor based in Essex County. I use mindfulness techniques with my own patients during office visits, and I'm here to tell you how you can prevent addiction. It is a way to train your brain to manage pain. Reducing your pain through mindfulness could mean you need less medication or a safer type of medication. It can also help you reduce your stress and recover from past trauma. That means you become less likely to develop an addiction, whether opioids, alcohol, or any other substance. In brain research, we scan people's brains before they start practicing mindfulness and after they've been practicing it daily for eight weeks. We see actual changes in the way their brains are wired. We see those people drawing more on their judgment and reasoning skills, resulting in safer behaviors. Massachusetts has great resources about effective mindfulness techniques. To find out more, go to massmed.org. He has a golf cart. That's weird. I think it's Tony. Waiting on the snap. Tony's going to throw it. Oh, long toss. Almost intercepted.
That was a good play by Gavin. Smacking the ball down out of the air. Mascot's getting a lot of attention right now. They gained three, four. It was, oh, did a spin move. We didn't gain that much. Almost got the first down with about two yards to go, four and two. Really? It is fourth down, they're going for it. They did not, did they get it? It was incomplete. They did not get the first down. It is Hiller's ball. <laughs> Absolutely terrific field position for Hopkins to now with only about 30 yards to go to get another touchdown. You should be you should be a guy that like Smash the like button if you enjoy that. <laughs> <laughs> like, comment and share. Describe to Matthew Cruz. No, I'm just kidding. Um Yep. 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 Mr. Van Beek, what do you got to say? Nothing. Okay, good talk. Okay. The mascots looking at oh the mascots really chilling right now. Cheering for these Hillers. Love the Hillers. Oh. Passed over. Oh. Gained a couple yards. Oh. Gained like two yards, three yards. That was seven yards. Huh. That was some that was a good run for the Hillers. It is a second down at the twenty three. Pipe it down over there, mascot. What are you doing? What? What? Getting ready for the snap. Oh, the ball was dropped. But the Hillers received it. That could have been a very bad fumble for the Hillers as they are still down a couple points. I think they're doing track. Getting ready for the snap. Wide is running. Got a couple yards. And now fourth down. I 
I think they're going for it. Ooh. 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 You guys came late. Holy crap. Looks like their second quarterback is coming in now, Mr. Sam Pantera at number eighty seven. Sam's going to throw it. It's been caught. But they were short. Oh, nope. They got the first down. That was just what Hoptington was looking for. Just in that first down play. Thanks, Chris. <laughs> so what are the signs of an opioid overdose? And how can I recognize that somebody is experiencing one? Well, they're actually pretty easy to spot. A person who is experiencing an overdose may appear confused and have a decreased level of consciousness and alertness. They also may have constricted pupils. When you see somebody who's experiencing an overdose, the number one most important thing to do first is to call 911. Next, do rescue breathing. And finally, take out your naloxone kit and administer the naloxone. Naloxone comes in an easy to use package with instructions for how to use it. Each box of naloxone may look different. They're all very easy to use and you do not need medical training in order to use it. So who should have nasal naloxone? Well, everybody should have it to help a loved one who may be suffering from a substance abuse disorder or just to help a stranger in need. Obtaining naloxone is easy. You can obtain it from your doctor, from a pharmacy standing order, or from any of the Department of Public Health sites. By just following these simple steps, you might just be able to save a life. Wyatt Stevens is actually back in at quarterback, and they have switched sides on the field. Nice turn out of that sack, but ends up getting sacked anyways. Mascot's just chilling. Rooting for the Hillers. Why? Then leave. No, it's just like you just did it too much. I bring up the mascot. The mascot's just chilling. <laughs> you just like every time you get on the mic, the mascot. <laughs> that mascot's just chilling, Mr. Hiller. Staring at me again. What? Hayden's horrible at. Did you ever play football? You play hockey like a chum. What? Wide Steven. Over to 26. Breaks tackle. Still going. Oh, he's still going. That run was Devin Canty. Got the first down and some. Going to talk about this play that's going to go on. Maybe lined up. No, say is it lined up ready to go? Line up wide, Steven, over 26. Devin. It's not Devin. Oh, it is Devin. Come on, get it straight. You just, same dude. Same dude. Was it that hard? It is actually pretty hard. You want to do it? How about you do it? Merry Christmas. I'm helping you. Devin Canty lost about two yards on that play. 
brings it to a fourth and four situation. Looks like Hopkinton is going for it. <laughs> what? That's not. You say the name, you're gonna say That's not the right team. That's the team right there. Wyatt Stevens. Wyatt Stevens, running up with the ball. Out of bounds at the. No, that wasn't ten. That was like two yard, two line, two yard line. That was a two yard line, bud. How does Mike Trojan do this? Your dad. Westwood gets a first down at their own seven yard line. Long ways to go on this drive. Devin Canty and Wyatt Stevens. Wyatt Stevens. Oh, drops to Devin Canty. Devin Canty just dropped the ball. Westwood just received the ball. Someone. <laughs> <Here he is. laughs> okay. Tony passes the ball. I don't know his name. Westwood makes it to the 10 yard line with a second and five situation now. Hopkinton comes to the line. Pass off. Lost some yardage on that one. That makes it a third and eight. Fourth and two for Westwood now. Teams are set for the snap. Punt off. Blocked the punt. Westward recovers. That gives Hopkinton very good field position for this next drive. Yeah. 
Wyatt Stevens is now coming in to call the play for Hopkinton. Hopkinton comes up to the line. Westwood is showing a potential blitz on this play. Good pass and a touchdown for Hopkinton. I think that puts Hopkinton over Westwood now. Hopkinton sets for the extra point attempt. Wyatt Stevens goes for the run in. And he gets it. We now have a kickoff from Hopkinton. Their kicker, Avery Ravek. Ravich, sorry. Onside kick from Hopkinton, picked up by Westwood. Recovered at the 38-yard line by Westwood. Time out. Are you worried about letting your child take the wheel? Maybe you should also be worried about what you're doing behind the wheel. Have you ever sent a quick text just this once? Well, that might turn into a catastrophic accident. Monkey see what monkey do. If you do it, why wouldn't your child? In a child's brain, almost all things their parents do, they can do too. 78% of teen drivers' surveys text and drive. 59% said their parents do it too. Stop texting and driving, because if you do it, your child will too. Hopkinton combats out on the field now. Quick little pass off from Westwood's quarterback. They got about a three yard gain from that drive. Second and seven now. At the 42. With the snap, quarterback Tony runs it himself, tries to go for the first down, and is about four yards short. Soon I'll be doing golf. 
Really? No. No. <laughs> I was kind of sad. I love That's what? funny. You, you said it with a straight face too, and I was like, no. I was like, I was <laughs> no. Like, wait, I don't think that's like, a thing. I was like, gonna that's going to be so boring. Yeah. You'd have to pay me like 50 bucks just Not to do that. Bad. Like, 50 bucks just to walk the course. Yeah. Like, period. Never mind film it. 100 bucks, I'd do it. Yeah. For nine holes. Yeah, if it's 18? Another 100 dollars. That's actually not a bad idea. We could walk until they're on golf. <laughs> <laughs> Why does Mitch have it? Westwood comes up to the line. Because they have some. Yeah, golf cart. Quarterback Tony passes it off. Good run down the side. Not enough for the. First down. Makes it a four and three situation now. Hopkinton set. Oh! Wide open. 20. 10. Touchdown Westwood with the sneak quarterback play. Looks like the mascot is uh, unhappy about that one. Westwood lines up for the extra point. Westwood easily runs it in by Tony Moran for the extra point. It's you, the board, the board, ah. <laughs> Yeah. Westwood goes for the kickoff back to Hopkinton. Onside kick pit received by Hopkinton. They rush for about. They lateral back and get dropped. Oh, they lateral again. Hopkinton's going. They're at the 50. He's still going. Lateral again. Fumble. Westwood picks it up at the 50. Who was that? My God. That did not just happen. That seems to be the game. Lining up for the handshake. I believe Westwood has won. Yeah. 
He played very well. Any last words, Matthew? It was a good game overall. <laughs>